the first time in seven years that parts of the U.S. will experience a total solar eclipse. Creepers! Good morning, afternoon, or evening, whenever you guys are tuning in and creeping with. We got Fred G. Myers, local grocery store behind us. It's solar eclipse day. I'm excited, even though the skies are a little overcast. Probably won't be able to see it, but I'm in the search for the, the little glasses. That way you can still look at everything. Once in a lifetime opportunity. I think there was like a solar eclipse not too long ago, but this is the full total eclipse of the heart. <laughs> so stay tuned. I'm excited. I hope you guys are having a great day. Whenever you're creeping with, I always appreciate it. Yeah, the skies are a little overcast, so we probably won't be able to see it today. But nonetheless, we're going to start off here at Freddy's. Creeper Cruiser looking good. And see if we can find some of the glasses. That way, if we do happen to see a glimpse of it, we don't, you know, hurt our eyes later. Stay tuned. It's going to be a good day. Freddy's have got their new summertime little guys up. All right, they said check in apparel. Oh, look at these guys are cute. I always love showing their little characters. Check in apparel for their glasses. All their sunglasses, but I don't see any of the buy one, get one regular price. Yeah, I don't see any of the solar glasses. Ah, oh, that's too bad. I'll go double check real quick. Yeah, just a regular, regular shades. These are pretty cool though. And have my favorite little soda display too. Very spring vibes. Yeah, this LaCroix is good. I like the coconut one. Like, ah, you probably won't be able to see it with the overcast skies anyways. I said, well, it's pretty much just for the commodity at this point. So maybe we'll try another place. Yeah, I thought for sure they'd have them. That's okay. It's kind of fun just trying to find them. The, the glasses. You definitely don't want to look at the sun without them though, or the moon, however that works. That's an interesting way to start the, start the morning. Huh. So here's two times the power solar eclipse viewing kit. So they do have one here at Big Five. We just poke the camera in. I'm wondering if this is the only ones that Lex Kerr has to associate here in a second. These are like kind of like a little box. Are these the only ones you guys have? Yeah, unfortunately those are only Ah, uh, gosh, that's kind of pricey, guys. Sorry, I didn't mean to put you on video. I'll edit that part out. <laughs> Dang it. So I'm looking for just like the cheap ones. <laughs> these are probably the legit ones where you don't actually lose your vision, though. When we... But $14.99 is a little pricey for just one event that might not be able to see <laughs> last year or last summer we got like the just single like yeah that's the ones i'm looking for the like 3d looking ones yeah um, when was the last one was it 2019 gosh i, didn't I don't remember. remember the last one zapped our memory yeah no <laughs> um okay well at least you guys have these because no one's got any so that's good to know this is again this is what big five yes big five so come down here if you need these ones I mean t two of them for seven and you know you're getting the right ones isn't too bad not getting glare on the sides here yeah so for like for like catching probably more than pitching yeah and then also for those are neat they're really like low so if you're wearing them on the right helmet it doesn't oh that'd be good for biking actually too yeah probably well thanks for your info bro yeah of course those are pretty styly nonetheless <laughs> I don't think I could pull them off though. <laughs> Who was the pitcher that used to rock those? I think it's Matting Leg or somebody. Could be. Back in the 80s. Kind of full circle on the on the styles. I'm not sure. And yeah. they got all the mitts too. So yeah, it's a great store. Even if you don't need the solar lenses come in, they got all kinds of stuff. Yeah, with the skies being like it is, probably won't even be able to see it anyways. But I really do like these folks here at Big Five. They are really helpful. Great employees. 
started sprinkling on me a little, but that's not gonna stop me. Oh yeah, we're in for a special treat. Uh, the sky's looking a little... <laughs> the sky's looking a little... A little dreary, but a little bit of blue. Next stop, as promised, Krispy Kreme. Go in here and grab a special donut that they're only doing for just a few days for the eclipse. I do see it, but I don't see any in the rack. I'm hoping okay. they still have one. Do you guys still have any of the eclipse ones? Um, do you have any of the eclipse ones? Hot off the presses. Nice, look at those. Got the Oreo on top. Yeah, I'll just grab one of those, bud. These look amazing. We're in business, they just put some new ones out. Founder Vernon Rudolph first started wearing a paper hat at work in the summer of 1937 as he hand mixed dough and glaze for the perfect recipe. Join the fun, grab a hat. Don't mind if we do. If I can get it. Lighting's a little weird. Let's see. Yeah, the sky's a little weird. It's kind of dark. But nonetheless, we've got our Eclipse Donut. Wow, yeah, that is. There we go. Now we're in business. Normally I bring my tripod, but I left it on accident. But there you have it. There was none in the case, but when we walked in, they fished us out of the back. I'm gonna set you guys down just for a minute, put the, put the paper hat on, then we'll dive into this. But yeah, Krispy Kreme back at it again. Got the hat on, got the Eclipse Donut. We're gonna dive right in. Yeah, it's got black frosting, I don't know about this thing. Mm. Got the cream leaking on the bottom there. I like the crunch from the cookie. That's pretty dang good. My favorite still is their Homer donut. Basically like an Oreo flavored, got the cream inside. So it's sweet, I thought it'd be a little bit Less sweet because the frosting being that color. Pretty good. Now we just gotta find the actual glasses to wear. But you don't need certain glasses to see this bad boy. Especially inhaling it. Tastes better when you're wearing the hat too. give it about a seven and a half out of ten not bad they're always really sweet the cream filled ones are usually like maybe one and done usually if I have a coffee I can eat a couple this is the uh, Krispy Kreme on 82nd right on the cusp between Portland and Clackamas Happy Valley that was good not their best but pretty good and they said Oregon will not see pretty much any of it <laughs> but I wanted to document it nonetheless we might actually find a break in the sky to see it I for one can't look at it because we don't have we didn't buy the glasses but we might be able to at least aim the camera up hopefully it doesn't affect the lens or anything I'm not sure how that all works I know you're not really supposed to aim your camera directly at the Sun but I do all the time yeah, we'll see. 
how this all pans out. That is so cool. That's going to do it for today. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. That'll dial you into being a creeper today. You can also ring that bell. That way when I creep, you guys will be the first to creep. And if you did enjoy this, give it a thumbs up. Till next time, creeper out for now. Peace.